and welcome back to my channel. Sorry I didn't film an intro today, but everyone was making way too much noise in my house for me to even bother or even try to do that. Today I filmed this gold smoky Kylie Jenner inspired look. I saw this makeup look filmed on her app when styled by Harush did her makeup and I went and purchased the gold Colourpop eyeshadow ASAP and couldn't wait to film this look. So I hope you like this hooded eye inspired makeup eye tutorial. It is super easy to do so make sure you subscribe if you haven't already liked this video and leave a comment below and PS do you see how long it takes to film an intro with all this fast forwarding of clips. I mean oh my god guys it is so exhausting you don't even realise. And I also look like the biggest psycho going around. I mean let's be real. So anyways, let's just jump straight into the makeup look. So first I have already prepped my eyes and then I'm going to be creating a sharp line using scotch tape as usual, measuring it up with my brows. This is a tip that I did learn from Kylie Jenner herself. Then I'm using Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Kit to start my eyes and using this brown shade Java and the Coastal Scents Crease Brush, pressing it along the tape and then into the crease and blending it out using the Sigma Tapered Blending Brush. Then I'm going to be using Havana, which is more of an orange shade and the same Sigma brush and applying it into the crease and blending upwards. Then using Colourpop Shock Shadow in Mittens on the outside corner of my eye, just blending it in to deepen up the colour. And then I'm going to apply the shimmery brown shade called On The Rocks with my finger just to the outer corner of my eye to add that shimmery shade. Then using the main colour, which is this amazing bronzy goldy shade it's amazing and it's called game face Kylie Jenner herself used this for the eye look and that's where I got it from so that is that then I'm going to use the Sigma Soul palette you can use any black shadow you have I'm just going to do sort of a soft lining using this black shadow I'm going to wet this angled brush it's a very thin angled brush and sort of creating like a liner but it just works better with hooded eyes I think for mascara, then I'm going to use the Clinique Volume Mascara and then I will be applying false lashes, of course. I got this whole packet from eBay and it was only $1.50. They aren't the best lashes, but great for when you're on a budget just like me. And I just searched false lashes, but the brand says Dingson, I think is what they're called. Then I'm using the Colourpop Highlighter in Wisp to brighten up the inner corner of my eye. And now the part, the eye part is done and that was super, super easy. I'm going on to foundation using my go-to foundation Estee Lauder Double Wear in Tawny and using a small flat brush to apply and then blending it in with a damp blending sponge. Then after I've moisturized my very dry lips, I'm going to conceal using the MAC Pro Longwear Concealer in NC20 just because this is a super, super full coverage. And I feel like if you want to have that Kardashian look, you need that really full coverage concealer. And then after I've applied it with this thin brush, I'm going to blend it in using the same damp sponge, which I did get off by invite.com and it was super cheap. And then once I have blended all of that in, I'm going to set the rest of my face Again, using the Anastasia Beverly Hills palette and the banana shade, which is giving me life right now. And then today I'm bronzing using the same bronze shade in Havana around my forehead and then also along my temple and cheeks. Not sure if I over bronze too much today, but you know, I feel like you can never have that much bronzer. Then for cheeks, I'm using the Bobbi Brown Shimmer Brick in Bronze just to add a little bit of shimmer. To highlight, I'm going to use Wisp again from Colourpop to highlight and I'm going to just really go hard with the highlight and blend it in with my fingers on my cheekbones. Like, look at this glow, people. Then I'm using the same short shader. I'm creating a small black line to connect this to the top line just to really add to the smoke. And then I'm going to go ahead and use this small pointed brush and I'm going with On The Rocks, that brown shade again, along my entire lower lash line once I have had a drink break I'm going to do my lips using the NYX natural liner to really emphasize and really overdraw my lips but not too massively I'm not a fan of going too over the top with that and then I'm going to be using the Maybelline color drama jumbo lip pencil in the shade in the nude it's the perfect perfect nude shade oh and I wasn't happy with how my dark my eyes were so I just went in with a little bit more of Havana and also in a black shade just to really set set the dark smokiness that I really wanted to get. There you have it. This is my finished look. Obviously, I hope you liked my Kylie Jenner inspired makeup look for hooded eyes. Make sure you like this video if you like it and please subscribe if you'd like to see more. I really hope you enjoyed this and that you want to recreate it. Let me know if you do recreate it. I will really appreciate it and I will see you guys very, very soon. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.